Okay, so you always need to do charge, right? So let's say we're going to look at charge. We have a tau involved here, so we're going to have to look at the tau number. Okay. We have a tau involved, and we have to look at the tau number here. So let's figure out what this thing is. <laughs> I didn't take my shift key. Okay, that's fine. Okay, so charge, this one's a minus one. And then this is minus one, that's zero, right? It's minus because of the minus there. That's zero because there's a zero there, right? And so, um, let's see, charge is already balanced, so this thing's gonna have no charge. Okay, so let's look at L tau. Well, this is the regular tau, right? A tau minus is the regular tau, so it's charge, it's, uh, sorry, it's lepton number is um, one, right? Pions are not leptons, <laughs> okay? It's not on the list, so it's not a lepton. So this is zero and zero. So therefore, this unknown thing is a one, okay? Well, which tau has zero charge? Well, it's this guy, right? Here's the charge, it's gonna be this one. Okay, so this is a, a, a tau neutrino. Yeah, I can't really draw that. I'm tau neutrino impaired for my drawing, but there it is. That's our missing particle. 